80 to 71. Sam Laporta, not ranked last year to 80. I'm fine with that. Okay, Minka Fitzpatrick. Whoa, he dropped off a cliff. Look at that. 61. Kyron Williams, yeah. 78. I'm okay with that. Him and Puka Nakua, man. Like, it was like, oh my gosh, here come the Rams. So, and if he's at 78, you know, Nakua is going to be higher. But is Stafford going to be higher, too? It, it's just silly. Okay. In his rookie season, Williams only rushed for 139 yards in 10 games played. What? That changed in the 12. Oh, yeah, because he was a rookie in 22. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, trying to Trey Hendrickson going down two spots. Dre Greenlaw going up three spots. I'd have him probably maybe just a titch higher just because that San Francisco defense. However, things took a turn in Super Bowl. Yep, when he suffered a torn Achilles. That was such a stupid, oh, that was such a sad play. How, tore his Achilles just running out onto the field. Like, oh, it, oh, it was awful. Dropping 43 spots, Justin Herbert at 75. Despite having a season shortened by a broken finger, Herbert's peers believe that the Chargers QB was worthy of a selection. Herbert finished the 2023 campaign with uh, 3,100 yards passing and 20 touchdowns with 228 yards and three touchdowns on the ground. The Chargers will have a new regime in Los Angeles with John Harbaugh, and Herbert already has a new head coach. That is starstruck. Um, Herbert, I'm fine with him being on this list of the top 100 him dropping 43 spots to 75, like, I'm okay with that because there's a lot of hype behind Justin Herbert, and I might sound like a hater when I come off saying this. Herbert, to me, is getting in that lane, tier, whatever you want to say, where he's turning into Dak Prescott, where, okay, you can put up big stats, you can put up big numbers, but where are the wins? QB wins are very important in this league, and it's a stat that nobody talks about, but the difference between... Herbert and Joe Burrow. Herbert, statistically speaking, you could argue is better than Joe Burrow, but the Bengals still win. And the Bengals get more important wins, bigger wins. They win divisions. Chargers aren't a threat to the Chiefs. Would that change with Harbaugh as the head coach? Yes. But like, they kind of cleaned house last year. They got rid of Keenan Allen. They got rid of Austin Eckler. We're just going to see what the Chargers are doing this season. I have zero expectations. But it's just one of the... Plus, he's dealing with his foot thing. Like, I don't remember it off the top of my head. Let me look it up real quick. It's a foot injury. Foot in Spanish, no. <laughs> foot injury. Uh, Justin Herbert. A plantar fascia injury in his right foot following Wednesday's practice. He, oh, no, that's when he cracked his ribs against the Chiefs. Tough son of a bitch, I tell you what. Ah, uh, okay. Bottom of the foot. Garrett Wilson at 72, going up two slots. I mean, Garrett Wilson could only jump so high because he, look who his quarterback was last season. I'm telling you, with a healthy Rodgers, Garrett Wilson's going to be a top 25 player. He's going to be up there. Um, he might be in contract disputes like how Justin Jefferson is, where it's like money cut. 